Do you do anything special like to start the year like it's a new year? Do you do anything like that? I I have a thing. I don't love resolutions. Me neither because I, don't know if you, I are you fail at them. Too? Me yeah. too. I, I mean, set them too high. I think I do the same yeah. and then I I feel bad 3 4 weeks in when you're like, "Oh, I'm back to doing." Yeah. The, I don't feel bad about thing. it, but I do <laughs> feel at it. <laughs> I see I did and then I realized I was like, "Well, why am I doing this?" You know, so yeah. I I tend to do a word which is oh. easier, and it's a little bit more of an intention, right? So it's not so... You pick one word? One word. Okay, what's and your word? The, so this year is embody, which okay. for me, a lot of people are very confused by this word, but I'm for not, me I it like means a lot. Yeah. It's like the physical element of it, of course, you know, actually yeah. like being healthier, but then the living and breathing your talk and you know walking your talk embodying and, what yeah, words embodying say, your words yeah. and embodying yeah. how, you, how you would like that's to that's hard live. i think you did set a really hard goal there but i feel like, like <laughs> it's depending on what you're saying i guess you're like come december i'm like i have embodied nothing <laughs> <laughs> but maybe nothing. that's nice being still we never yes. do that yeah well that's the thing is like the little decisions yeah. i make throughout the day you know trying to make the small choices better so that you overall feel better yeah but i have found when i started doing that you would get to the end of the year and you would see how that was sort of like an intention for your whole year. It's in your subconscious, I believe. Yeah, yeah. when you set some kind of intention like that. And it's boring if you yeah. don't set any kind of goal or intention. That's boring. Yeah, and I'm super woo-woo yeah. in this way. I've Me always too. Been you too? Yes. Have we never talked So I, well, I've watched your show. You did a show. Like, is it Witches of Eastside? You did Witches it. Witches of Eastside. Yes, we, we did talk. Love. <gasps> yes. Witches, yes. Yes, yes. I love it. So you're into all things like kind of mystical, yes. right? Yeah, Have that's... you been like that since you were a kid? Always, but no one in my family really was. So I was definitely, you eat her. Yeah, and I like totally believe in magic. Like, yeah. For sure. Because I've experienced it. I've experienced feeling like magic. That's nice. And it is wild when, when you put something out there and you actually take steps to achieving something, when it happens, you, you definitely feel magical. Yeah, and I feel <laughs> like, like people that me. don't believe in it aren't open to it. That's true. It's on and you. it is kind of like what you believe you create, you know? Yeah. So I'm, I'm oh, with that. Yeah. yeah, Witches was funny because I, I was, love that show, yeah. did that role, but I was already Freya in so many ways. No, that's what I was, was going like, to say. Did that attract this. you to that role because you already liked that kind of stuff? Yes. That's yes. Cool. I saw that and I was like, oh, this is going to be fun. Yeah, I, I know this. your projects, girl.